Hey everybody, welcome back to Royal Tarot Readings. This is my fun channel that I do for tarot readings on the royal family. All information presented in this video is for fun and entertainment purposes only. It's fun. It's tarot. I'm just a gal with cards. All right, so today I would like to look at, and first before I say anything, I wish nothing but the best for the Princess of Wales and for His Majesty the King. I hope both of them recover very quickly and I send nothing but good vibes and thoughts to them both. All right, so let's take a look at the health of both the Catherine, uh, Catherine, Princess of Wales, and His Majesty the King, King Charles. So today I'm going to use the Ethereal Visions Illuminated Tarot deck. Really, really pretty gold deck with lots of beautiful illustrations and um, tends to be a little mystical. So I really am um, getting good vibes from this deck. So, all right, so let's take a look here. Let, as you know, the Princess of Wales was taken to the hospital um, for what they said was a planned procedure. Um, if she suddenly had to cancel all her engagements through Easter, I don't know why this was, This they're saying this is planned. I don't think this was planned. I think this was an unexpected happening. Um, just my opinion, uh, my personal opinion from <clears throat> what I've seen and um, from what I've heard from readers um, and from viewers, um, it does sound like uh, maybe... Um, uh, a pregnancy gone bad, maybe. I did predict a pregnancy for her for February for this year. For fe so I wonder if this was um, something to do with that. Um, and for the king, um, we all have known that he's, he's had some kind of health issue. I don't think that his sausage fingers, as they call them, are due to the prostate. But let's just take a look at their health, both of them, and see how they're doing. Um, anyway, so my questions. <clears throat> all right, we'll start shuffling here. Is the Princess of Wales... Catherine, Princess of Wales, is she suffering from what they call an ectoptic pregnancy, where the pregnancy actually does not attach to the uterus, it goes in the fallopian tubes, and it can be a huge, huge health issue. If it ruptures, it can actually, it, it can be very fatal. So, is that what she's suffering from? Is she suffering from an ectoptic pregnancy? And that's what caused this hot, sudden hospitalization for, for such a length of time and such a long recovery. Is that what it is? Um... And will she recover completely? Will she recover completely? Whoops. Let me get there. Um, the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. It, it, yeah, she's going to have a long recovery, it looks like. It did say she wouldn't return until Easter. She's, she's going to fight it, though. She's definitely going to fight it. All right. Um, battered and bruised, but she's in for the fight. Okay. So, um, next question is, um, will the king's... Oh, did the king's prostate issues was that caught in I goodness these cards want to talk already <laughs> my goodness all right all right did did the I can't talk all of a sudden um was the king's prostate issue caught in time because prostate cancer when caught early is um it, for a large prostate it's it's you know very very favorable they catch it early was this caught in time was this caught in time these cards just don't even want to hear the rest of my questions. Okay, um, I've got I've got a couple more. I got three more. Um, and will the king recover completely? Will the king recover completely from the prostate issue? Will he recover completely? And how's how's Prince William doing? How's the Prince of Wales doing? How's he holding up? And it looked like he was putting out a statement. He was taking. He was also canceling some of his engagements. Um, to look after Catherine and the children. So how is William doing? How is Prince William doing? And, let's see, my last question is here. Actually, I have two more. Um, my next question is, is, is Prince Harry worried about his father? Is he worried about his father? Is Prince Harry worried about his father? Oops. Oh, judgment. Wow. All right. Really? Oh, and the Eight of Swords. Oh, my goodness. The cards are already talking to me. My goodness. All right. And my last question is, will the king's health be good this year? Will the king's health be good this year? And I will explain why I'm asking that question as soon as I get done with the shuffling. Um, will the king's health be good this year? <clears throat> Nine of Cups. All right. Will the king's health be good this year? 
All right, we're going to go with this one. Oh, wow. What an interesting cut. I don't think I've ever had a cut like that before. All right. So I have actually seven questions. We are going to do seven cards. All right. So I am asking about the king's health because in several readings that I've done with all the family members, including the king, I have seen multiple health, health issues for him this year, especially around August or September. So, um, all right. We have seven questions. That's the reason why I'm asking that question. All right. Underline energy. The queen of pentacles in reverse. I was going to ask another question, but I didn't. All right. And then we have the sun as well. And the world. My goodness. Oh, goodness. All right. All right. So the queen of pentacles in reverse. This can sometimes represent Megan. It's, it also actually can sometimes represent Catherine, too. Um, in my readings, this tends to represent Catherine. Uh, but this is indicating that she is feeling very, very poorly. She, um, it, it can also represent feeling very vindictive, very, very mean-spirited. Um, but it can indicate how what she's in poor health. And then the sun... The sun is about warmth and success and vitality and bringing things into the light. I think whatever has happened to her is going to be brought into light. It's going to be admitted, what, whatever she's in the hospital for. Um, and then and the world will see and accept this, um, accept this announcement, whatever it is. Okay. All right, interesting. All right, so our first question is, is Catherine suffering from an ectopic pregnancy? Oh, the King of Wands in reverse. The King of Wands upright can be about um, authorities. This sometimes represents the police. Um, oh my goodness. I almost want to say something, something, something else happened to her. Okay, so um, so the King of Wands. All right, so in tarot, wands usually refer to the um, your life force, your she, as you in Chinese astrology, um, uh, controls everything in your body. And the King of Wands in reverse is about unexpected, sudden change. You had high expectations and you were overconfident, and suddenly everything crashed. All right, so whatever it was, it was unexpected. And with it being about the life force, I wonder if it was an unexpected pregnancy that went bad. Okay, so so the, okay, the Queen of Pentacles, this rep definitely represents Catherine, and she's in reverse. This can be about self-care, needing to take care of yourself, your balance between home and work is disrupted. Okay, I was thinking of the Queen of Swords. This is the Queen of Pentacles. Oh, that definitely represents Catherine. Okay, so she's definitely down and out. Um, but she has a great, great chance of success, of recovery, and it'll be in front of the world. It'll be, everything's going to be um, uh, transparent, as they say. But this that occurred, this was sudden and unexpected. She may have had something going on in the background, and they weren't worried about it. She was taking medicine for it. Things were seemed to be okay, and suddenly something terrible happened sounds like they've got a handle on it um, because she is going to have a good recovery a good outcome and it will be in, it'll be very transparent everything will be announced as to what happened but it was extremely sudden I don't care they said it was planned it was not planned if anything was planned it was maybe a routine check but this whatever happened was not expected and it was very it was it could have been fatal. It could have been fatal. Um, okay, so will she recover completely? Will the Princess of Wales recover completely? All right, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. She's going to have to work hard at it. It's going to be a long recovery. This is about perfectionism. They are going to make sure she is absolutely perfect. They're going to work hard at taking care of her, and she's going to be frustrated because um, she's a 
she's a she's a Capricorn Leo ascendant. She's she wants control of everything. She it's she's gonna be frustrated, but it's gonna be baby steps. She she will recover, and she will recover um, very well. She will recover very well, but it's going to take time. It will take time. They said two to three months. I I wouldn't be surprised if it took even longer. She she will recover, but it will take time. It's gonna take a lot out of her. All right. Um, were the king's prostate problems caught in time? It's the three of cups in reverse. Um, this is about going it alone. You're isolated. Um, and it has to do, yeah, with the world. It'll be successful. It'll be, they'll announce what it is. I wonder, it had something to do with, hmm. He's been worried about Catherine. He's been worried about her. So I think that he's been ignoring it for a while, and it finally did catch up to him. I think they did catch it in time. But he feels alone. He feels uh, He feels like, uh, I almost feel like he, he caught it by himself. Hmm. He feels very solitary. He feels um, this was, it was his decision, apparently. That's very odd. That's a tough one. I, I, I think they did catch it in time. But I think it's more serious than they're saying. I think it's more serious than they're saying. Okay. Will the king recover completely? Will the king recover completely? The Two of Cups reversed. Okay, so upright is about a, a partnership, um, a love partnership. And in reverse, oh, his body is out of sync. Okay, so he, oh, you know what? His body is out of sync. Uh, he felt it, and he was trying to treat himself with herbal remedies. That must be what this is about. He tried to heal himself by himself. Something was definitely off with his body, with the with the prostate, and um, he he had to get help for it. Um, I think it's going to be revisited. I think they're going to revisit this issue again with him. It's not done. There must there's going to be something else they find. That's interesting. How's William doing? How is Prince William doing? I think we all know the answer to this one. Oh, the Ace of Cups in reverse. He's just worried. He's got, he's trying to repress his emotions. Ace of Cups is about love and just passion and, and pregnancy of, oh my God. I think this was a pregnancy loss. This would, maybe this was an optic pregnancy. However you say it, I know I'm saying it wrong. Repressed emotions, this can be about a miscarriage, a, a infertility, a loss of a baby. I think they did lose a baby. He's got repressed emotions, of course. He's trying to keep it together, trying to keep it together. He's worried about his wife, of course he is. And it's everyone can see, but it, it will turn out okay. I think this absolutely was a, a, a toxic pregnancy. It, with that card, absolutely. I wasn't sure, now I'm sure. Yep. I just got goosebumps, in fact. Oh, my goodness. Um, wow. Okay. So she may have had the top, the, the pregnancy, uh, the apoptotic pregnancy, and then maybe they had to do a hysterectomy at the same time. I don't know. I don't know. Allegedly, entertainment purposes only. All right. That card brought it into that. that this made, yep, that's it right there. Okay. Um, and is Harry worried about his father? Harry, you worried about your dad? Five of Wands. This is about conflict, disagreement, fighting, but nobody's listening. Asking people for opinions and everyone's telling you something different. So, running up against opposition. He may be telling people he's worried about his dad and people are just saying, oh, don't worry about him. What do you care about him? Forget him. He's worried about Catherine. He's going to publicly say something. 
He's not worried about his dad. He's worried about Catherine. Oh, wow. But he's... He, he can't... Oh, my goodness. He's worried about Catherine, but he can't say anything to his wife now, can he? Because if he does, she'll probably blow a gasket. Oh, my goodness. Boy, what do you think about that? Allegedly... He's not worried about his dad. He's worried about Catherine. All right. And my last question is, will the king's health be good this year? The two of swords. This is about a difficult decision. This is weighing up your options. You need to make a decision and you're avoiding the uh, making a decision. That's what the blindfold's all about. You know you've got a decision to make and it's tough, but you can't make one. You are deliberately avoiding making a decision. I think his health is not going to be good. And he's trying to decide what he's going to do about it. But why is it linked to Catherine? That's interesting. Whenever he, he does make a decision, and he will, of course, publicly announce it, he will feel that it's the right decision. And it's going to involve Catherine in some way. She may take on more of his du her his duties once she's better. And maybe he was going to announce it earlier, but he can't announce it now because she's ill. He's weighing on what he's going to do, if he's going to publicly announce it. His health is tied up with a big decision he has to make. So I'm going to take that as a no. His health is not going to be good this year. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I got goosebumps there, too. Oh, gosh. Okay. So let's wrap up here. Um, is Catherine suffering from an entoptic pregnancy? Um, I think she is. It, had, it, it interrupted her life force. It actually was much more serious than anyone realizes. But she will, she is, that's exactly what it is. It, um, and it involved William. They lost, they lost a baby. So, all right. Entoptic pregnancy. I think so. Is she going to recover completely? Yes, but it'll take a while. She will recover completely, but it is going to take a while. Um, and was the king's prostate caught in time? This is a tough one. Um, I think... I think so. I'm not sure. I am absolutely not sure on this card because he tried to cure it himself. He tried to go it alone with some maybe some herbal remedy or something that maybe he thought he could do. I don't know. I think that's still up in the air. Um, will the king recover completely? His body is out of sync. And Camilla's mad about it. I didn't pick that up before. This is about a love relationship. And of course, that's Camilla. She's mad at him about that because he did try to solve it himself and he, and he didn't do the right thing. So is he going to recover completely? I don't know. I, I, think, I, think, I think he will. And actually, Catherine's somehow, he's somehow linked to Catherine with this. She will help him in some way. The sun does give me a lot of optimism. I, th I mean, not the world, the sun. The sun does give me a lot of optimism that um, they did catch it in time, but I think there's some other issue involved. It's, he's got some issue, not only the prostate. That's why I think I'm not getting a decision. I'll do the pendulum. I'll ask the pendulum. Um, and how's William doing? He's, he's worried. He's got repressed emotions. It was, it was uh, this card represents a lost baby. Um, so, yeah. He's, he's, he's very sad. He's, he can't show all his emotions, but that's what it was. He's worried about Catherine, of course. Um, he's trying to keep it together. Is Harry worried about his dad? Nope, he's worried about Catherine. Not worried about Pop. Wow. And is the king's health going to be good this year? I don't think it will be, and he's already trying to decide what to do about it. He's already trying to decide what to do about it. All right, let's ask the pendulum. I thought I would be asking more about Catherine, but I'm going to be asking about the king. Oh, goodness. Okay. All right. We are going to be asking about King Charles. His Majesty the King. All right. 
uh, was the prostate issue caught in time? Will this completely resolve his prostate issue? Was this caught in time to prevent further problems? Was this caught in time for the king to prevent further problems? Was the prostate problem caught in time to prevent further problems? Was the prostate issue caught in time? Uh, okay, that's a yes. Okay, it was caught in time. Okay, good. That's good. Will the king's health be good this year? Will the king's health be good this year? After this is over, will the king's health be good this year? 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 Oh, yes. Oh, that's really good news. Okay, that's really good news. Okay. Okay, good. So maybe the issues that I saw for him in his chart was just his prostate business. But okay. Whew, that's good news. All right. <clears throat> There's my reading. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, if you did, please like and share. If uh, you are a subscriber, thank you so much. I appreciate all my subscribers. If you are not a subscriber, why well, you need to subscribe. Press that, press that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you don't miss another reading. Thank you so much, guys. I'll have a lot of readings coming out today. I'm trying to squeeze these in in between work and everything else. So um, thank you so much, and I will see you soon. Bye.